So guys, look, there's so much news to cover today. I can't do it all in three or four videos. I just can't cut stuff. There's so much important stuff. We're going to upload a whole shit ton of videos, which means you're going to get about eight or ten videos for the day. Hopefully, everything goes to plan. So guys, just enjoy the huge amounts of uploads, and I'm sorry for flooding your subscription boxes. Let's jump into it. German father charged for protecting his daughter against sexual assault by migrants. Not exactly true, but I don't think the father should have been charged. Let's jump into it. A man protecting his 21-year-old daughter against a bottom-groping African will be charged with causing bodily harm. At the Munsk Hagberg train station, I'm mispronouncing that, I apologize, a drunk 28-year-old migrant from... Edera, Edera, might be mispronouncing that, groped a German woman under her skirt on Tuesday. When her father saw the sexual assault, he punched the African man in the face to make him stop. Dude, you're lucky that's all you, that's all you, you're lucky that's all you got. Because if it had been me and you did that to my, my daughter or my girlfriend, you'd be leaving in a fucking body bag. But regardless. An employee of the German railway company Dustbahn witnessed the incident and alerted federal police. Interesting, but we'll keep going. The German police decided to file two charges, one against the migrant for sexual assault and one against the father for causing bodily harm. She left in a body bag. We would, probably would have got the same amount of treatment, but anyway. Many Germans were shocked by the case against the father, believing the man acted in defense of his daughter. Yeah, so much for protect women, hey. Comments below a Facebook post regarding those charges show that many do not understand why the father is being punished for protecting his daughter. Um, so, yeah, uh, it's up to the judiciary to assess the case uh, there is suspicion that there were two crimes, one sexual harassment and the other a physical injury. The police are required by law to bring both, spokeswoman Petra Vidima of Munich Police says. She advised people to use other options when a crime occurs at a station. People should address the security forces on the ground in a preventative way if something suspicious occurs, she added. So in other words, if someone gropes your daughter at a train station, don't do anything to provoke or to defend your, your daughter or anything like that. Just be a cuck and just take it. Just take it like a cuck. Really? Look, why, are you, why are you picking on the migrants is probably what they're going to argue. Um, and then that's that. Um, so look, yeah, it's a small article, guys. Look, to be honest, like, dude, if I had a girlfriend, because I don't at the moment, but if I had a girlfriend and someone did that to, to her, holy shit, you would be in a world of hurt. And, and I don't care if you're white, you're black, you're fucking whatever. Six foot four, built like a shit house, Dude, I'm still going to fucking try. Okay, regardless of whether I go to hospital or not, you go touching my daughter or my, my, my you know, because I don't have one, but my imaginary daughter or my, my girlfriend or anybody like that, or my, like if I had a sister, holy shit, if I had to go over and break off a street sign and use it as a knick-knack paddywhack and slam you with that thing, I would. So, yeah, like I say, uh, yeah. Now, I, look, I don't blame the father for doing it. Someone gropes your daughter at a train station, you probably would lose an arm back in the day. Just saying. Um, so, yeah, I, I, I look, I, I kind of hope that they're just filing the charges because it's formality. And I'm kind of hoping when it gets to court that the father was just the father's case will be dropped. Um, and definitely think the, fa the migrant should be charged with uh, sexual assault. Um, and what if the father hadn't been there? What if the girl was travelling on her own and he decided to take it further? Like, you know, it, I love the fact that these feminists stick up for women, you know, it's women's rights, but you can't literally get one of them to comment on something like this because 
well, we're going to protect women, but we don't want to come off as racist. So they literally just don't say anything. So, yeah, like, that, that, that victim points, they really do come in handy, don't they, sometimes? But guys, let me know your thoughts are in the comment section below. If you were at a train station and someone groped your daughter or your girlfriend or your sister, or whoever it may be, your mother, whatever it may be, how would you respond? What would you do? Would you attack the guy? Would you def would you defend your so your daughter, mother, sister, girlfriend, whatever it may be? Or, or would you be, no, nah, I'm not going to get involved in this. Like, hey, just knock it off sort of thing. What, what would you do? What would be your response? Let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. If this video has been helpful, please smack a like. If you're new to the channel, welcome and subscribe. Apart from that, guys, I'll see you in the next demonetized video from YouTube. Have a great night and enjoy.